Early on in the ministry, I went to Brooklyn, and there was an old minister who was a Jewish man from Poland who was both a pastor and he, had been, he was an Orthodox Jewish rabbi. He got saved. He, had been, he, had, he was an Orthodox Jewish rabbi in Poland, and he got saved. And he's spreading the gospel all over Brooklyn. And he laid hands on me for ministry. And he had himself first received his ordination as an Orthodox Jewish rabbi from a long line of Orthodox Jewish rabbis going back, back, back to ancient times. And then he came to the Lord and he received his ordination as a pastor, a minister of the gospel. He had both. He laid on, his hands on me for ordination, but you know what he called the, 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 the ordination? He called it the, the smicha. Why? Because, because in the rabbinical world, the name for being a rabbi being ordained is the smicha. And yeah, that's it. Rabbis know that. I mean, it's a, they, when you say smicha, that's what they'll think of. That's what it's the same. The ceremony is called the smicha. It comes from the Bible, not just from there. I mean, not just from what we just read. But here's the thing, and here's another part of the mystery. In Numbers and Deuteronomy, God says to Moses, "Go to Joshua and lay hands on him." And then it says he did. Deuteronomy 34, 3, it says he, Moses, at the end of Moses' life, he laid his hands on Joshua, and Joshua received the anointing. And then Joshua leads Israel. The word in Hebrew, when it says Moses did this, now there are many words could be used. He could have said he put his hands on it, he placed his hands on it, but the word is samach. Very specific word. It's not used throughout the Bible. It's only used in certain places. It's the samach, it's the smicha. And so it's the very same word that's used of putting the, the sins on the sacrifice is used of Moses anointing Joshua. In fact, this is where we get the practice of laying on of hands. Laying on of hands is the smicha. It comes from the smicha. The same word used for the sacrifice and confessing the sins onto the sacrifice is the same word used of Moses laying his hands on Joshua. This is also the smicha. The ordaining of a rabbi is called the smicha. But it's the same word. In Deuteronomy, Moses, he's laying his hands on Joshua, and it's a transference, again, but not of sin. It's a transference of ministry, of authority, of the office, of the mantle. To find out how you can receive more of Jonathan's teachings, to receive special free gifts, or get in touch, go to hopeoftheworld.org or call toll-free 1-800-YESHUA-1. That's hopeoftheworld.org or call 1-800-YESHUA-1. That's 1-800-937-4821. You can also get more at Jonathan Kahn's Facebook page or write us direct at Hope of the World, Box 1111, Lodi, New Jersey, 07644, USA. Hope of the World is dedicated to the goal of spreading God's word and salvation to every land and people. We do this by spreading the word throughout the world and sponsoring compassion projects to the most poor and needy around the earth. To get in touch or have a part in God's work, just write to Hope of the World, Box 1111, Lodi, New Jersey, 07644, USA. Or go to hopeoftheworld.org or call 1-800-YESHUA-1. That's 1-800-937-4821.